Hey babes, my name is Pranaz Arkage. For those of you who don't know, for those of you who do know, welcome back to my channel. Today I am very excited because not only am I going to be trying Mexican candies, I'm also going to be trying it with my sister because I think it would be very fun. Without further ado, <laughs> this is my sister. Hey guys, this is my sister, for those of you who didn't already know. Do you want to introduce yourself? My name is Jaina. I have a YouTube channel also. Yes. I volunteered to do this video with her because yes. I wanted to try these candies. Yes. And I wanted to be on this very special channel of hers. So, yes. so we have 11 pieces of... Pieces? <laughs> 11 different... 11 items. Yes. <laughs> yeah. 11... <laughs> 11... 11 different candies to try to try yeah. we're not going to be trying to pronounce these because then we'll yeah. just sound very slow but me and her we had um we wanted to try these first because obviously everyone knows what takis yeah. are takis are very um americanized you yes. can literally find them at any corner of the world yeah these are like the little mini takis yes everyone these knows it's just it different from the world. Yeah. everyone knows what takis are so obviously yeah. you guys already know what that is so if you don't, if you don't know what this tastes like, it tastes like a like a crunchy tortilla with like lime and like I would say it kind of tastes like hot Cheetos, but like, they're like different tastes. I'm not a really big fan of Takis anymore. Yeah, but the small ones kind of taste good. I used to love these so much, but I don't really have them like that anymore. Like yeah, the small ones. If I have the good. option to buy my own snacks, Takis like never end up like on that list to be honest. So I got water, obviously, but what do you rate it? <laughs> <laughs> I rate it like an 8 out of 10. Yeah. The small ones, I like the small ones better than the big ones. It hits different only when someone else has it. When you get it in that like big bag, it never hits the same. Exactly. I'm not sure if these are Mexican marshmallows, but they can. Yeah. We're just gonna... Like, like Bianchi. Yeah, Bianchi. Mini, 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 mini. I got this pink one. The thing with marshmallows, I like the taste, but like texture kind of bothers me. I'm a big person on textures, so it kind of has like a fruity taste on it, depending on the color. What do you rate these? Um, I would say like a 7.5. I rate these like a 6. <laughs> I don't really like them. I rate them like a six. Maybe a five. I don't really like Dang. marshmallows like that. You have this big marshmallow. It has to be a twist to this. It's yellow on the back and then pink, pink on the front. Yeah. Hold on. These taste way better than the small ones. Oh, these are like marshmallow marshmallows. These are good. These are my kind of marshmallows. This definitely tastes better than the last one. Mm. Well, because it's still marshmallows, I'm going to have to give it like... The same score. I give this an eight. This is good. I don't really want to try this thing. Okay. This, is, <laughs> this is boo boo loo. It's kind of one of those Snickers things, but like this has like. Yeah, this one reminds me of Snickers. Key, like, it has marshmallow inside. What's that jelly thing? <laughs> it's, I think it's like ha hair gel. Oh no. Okay. It's Wait. <laughs> <laughs> this is like hair gel. Five out of ten. Not my fave. I was trying to see if I liked it, but the only part I like is the chocolate taste. Okay, I like the, the only thing I kind of like about it is like in the beginning, like the aftertaste, it kind of has like an aftertaste of like three musketeers. I really like a 5 out of 10. Yeah, because at first I was trying to eat it. I was like, maybe this is good because the aftertaste yeah. makes you want to take another bite. Yeah, but like when you're chewing it, you're, you're getting a lot of stuff thrown at you. You know, it's kind of like... Yeah, it's kind of like, like all over the place. It's kind of <laughs> like all over the place. Calm down, please. Um, this looks very fascinating. This is called Paleton. Paleton. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it. I feel like this is going to taste just like the other thing. This is very interesting. No way. Yeah, I was right. It's the same thing without like the red part. Nope, not my favorite. Oh, this chocolate marshmallow combo ain't for me. Mm -mm. This is not for me. <laughs> <laughs> so far, the only thing I like is the Takis. <laughs> <laughs> so what did you rate that? Oh my god. This had a lower score than the chocolate one. This is like a <laughs> Get that a three. The three is like you would eat it. Yeah, but like, I mean, it wasn't like something that I ridiculously like spit it out right away because it, <laughs> it, it didn't have chocolate and I like chocolate, but chocolate and marshmallows don't roll together. The this, next thing we're gonna try is this. Oh my gosh. Ready? Okay. Sit, go. I have such high expectations. That's like peanut butter. They don't say peanut butter on here though. I'm disappointed. I had way better expectations. Let me taste it. Maybe in whole it tastes better. 
No. Not for me. Mm -hmm. It's just like eggs, kind of like when you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like yeah, that's eggs. That, that's, that's what I was looking for. Eggs inside of a batter. <laughs> yes. It ruins it. Yes, and you better. Oh, peanut butter. <laughs> A one. A one. Out of one. Ten. Absolutely ridiculous. <laughs> I would not try that again. I rate that a zero. I'm sorry. Wafer. Wafer filled with peanut butter and chocolate flavored coating. But guys, I've had good. This looks pretty convincing. It's good. Mmm. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm hmm. This is definitely. Yeah. Definitely mm. it. I like this one. Exactly. I can't even taste the peanut butter. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> We had to go through <laughs> 8.5 right off the bat. I like this one. Every taste like something that would be sold by that brand that made like the zebra cakes, the little Debbie cakes. Yeah. Like that brand. What did you rate that? I rate that like an 8.5. It was really good. I rate that a 7. A solid 7. It was good. It was good. Oh, what a 7. This one right here is called Duvaline. We have this in our home country. I had these in sixth grade. Um, They were really good, to be honest. I'm not going to tell you how I got them. She's going to taste it. She's going to taste the vanilla one. <clears throat> It's good. The strawberry one. It's even... I like the strawberry <laughs> one better than the vanilla one. I like the chocolate one. Yeah, the strawberry one is my favorite. I don't really like the chocolate one. Yeah. The I rate the one. chocolate one like a, <laughs> a five. I rate the chocolate one like a six. The strawberry one an eight, and then the vanilla one a seven. The strawberry one is definitely it's definitely a nine. I really like that. Yeah, same. It's a nine, and then the vanilla one is like a seven. <laughs> the chocolate one is doo doo. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to try this one first? Yes, yes. We are going to be trying <clears throat> pul pulparindo. <laughs> Sounds like a private part. I think it's like mango like tahin. Mm. I'm so excited. Yeah, me too. I it's really like spicy see. candies. Oh my gosh, very interesting. Set. Let's try it. Maybe we exaggerate. Hold on. Yeah. Maybe we exaggerate. Yeah. Okay, let's try it. No, I didn't exaggerate. Why is it spicy? Spicy, sugary. Like, where's the mango, man? They they <laughs> don't <laughs> seasoning to another level. Yeah, yeah I don't taste the mango. I taste mango time in I don't even know. Like a four. A four. They are high. That's so good. To myself, it was the one. <laughs> that was a terrible experience. Oh, I was not even able to eat like a piece. <laughs> I'm scared, bro. Maybe, maybe I'm exaggerating. Maybe I need water. Okay, who now? I'm not fair, uncle. on the lollipop you'll get a bit of mango yes but if you if, but if you're eating it like a regular person which i mean why wouldn't you be eating something as simple as a lollipop as a regular person yes you're definitely not gonna enjoy this <laughs> suck the middle suck yeah. inside Trust the process. How good? Mmm. Y'all kind of know what y'all doing. This is good. Ten out of ten. No. <laughs> That's <laughs> way too high. I'm too fast. Seven out of ten. Seven point five out of ten for me. I will give them an eight out of ten. Now for the Honey, last thing. Last but not least, Lucas salsa getty. I'm so excited. So I guess we're supposed. So to there's a sauce, and this is what you're supposed to put on the spaghetti. Now we'll try to put spaghetti alone first. Yeah, let's try the spaghetti alone. Mmm. I kind of like it. Kind of like it, kind of don't. Yeah, I just wish it didn't have the seasoning on it. Leave something good. Sometimes it tastes like rotten. And other times it tastes like 
the candy is supposed to. <laughs> I can't help but switching this vibe because that's what the candy makes me feel. My sister likes it for some reason. I don't, know. I don't really like it. I rate that a seven out of ten. It's like it's good, but at the same time, it's not. You know? Yeah. Um. That was like a three for me. I was really excited to try these candies though. I had a, like a lot of fun trying these candies. Yeah. Now I'm le I literally want to like start like a series trying different candies from different countries. But that will yes. definitely be in the future. Me and my sister will definitely be doing these types of videos on my channel. Um, yeah. There's going to be a series. You guys are going to see her a lot when we're trying yeah. different stuff from different countries. Um, this was very fun to make. What do you say? Very yeah, good. it was it was it was fun. Yeah, which one was your favorite? This, the Takis and the Lollipop, my favorite. <laughs> this one and the Takis are my favorite. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. All my social medias will be in the description down below. And make sure to check out my YouTube channel and my socials. And subscribe to RK. I'll see you next time. Bye! Bye.